What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I am back with another Fortnite video and today we have some of the latest news including repairs happening to Fortnite within Tilted Towers. What the heck? Uh, this week's blockbuster loading screen location and much more. But before we go any further guys, if you want to get your hands on some free V-Bucks, simply make sure you're subscribed to this channel and have that bell button ticked. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. Winners are picked and contacted via direct message here on YouTube at the end of the week. So good luck everybody okay so we are now into week three of season four every week if you complete the entire week's challenge as in all this week's challenges you are rewarded a loading screen wallpaper known as the blockbuster loading screen within these loading screens there are clues on the map for you to seek out and grab yourself 10 extra battle stars for that battle pass for free this week being week three if you have completed all this week's challenges you will receive this loading screen seen on screen now now if you look into the hologram of the Fortnite map, we see this right here. So that's where you need to head within the map. And I will show you guys exactly the location on screen now. Now I haven't done all this week's challenges yet, so this won't appear on my screen. But for those of you who have, head here and get those three battle stars. Okay, so we're going to move on, and if you haven't noticed guys, repairs have started happening to Tilted Towers. The meteor has been covered up. Yes, seriously, check it out. Now this is interesting, so each week I am guessing we might see repairs happen all over the map, and eventually the map will become free of meteor impact crater sites. Now that actually makes sense to me. Each season is themed. The Hot Rocks I guarantee won't be here for season 5, so this is their way of eliminating them by fixing the Meteor Impact sites and it sounds pretty cool. It's all speculation leading towards Season 5 though and what might happen and what might be the theme behind that season. We don't know yet, there's plenty of theories out there, there's plenty of speculation but there's no solid evidence yet. Now to be honest, although I do love the old new theme of uh, superheroes as such, the map for me isn't literally really that different besides the hot rocks and craters caused by the meteors. If I had a choice, I'd probably say, yes revert the map back to normal as the changes in my opinion weren't really that necessary. But hey, that's just my opinion. What do you think about this? Let me know down below within that comments section. Do you think we will see the whole map be repaired by the time season 5 arrives? Do you think it will lead up to the new theme? Let me know down below. Also guys, if you missed them, earlier today I covered some newly data mined outfits via a video and other items too, which looks super super cool. Those can be seen on screen now. Still at this point there are no names and rarity for these items, but damn, I don't care what rarity that V logo superhero is, he's mine when he comes available in game. He looks absolutely epic. Let's hope he's a rare though so he don't cost us that much V-Bucks, you know what I mean? But yeah, there's some great looking costumes here for sure. Them hazmat ones look great too, as well as that weird looking mermaid, merman, dragon looking fish thing. I don't know what that is, but it looks great. There's a few pickaxes too, a few gliders, and four new emotes. So that's great. But on that note guys, we are out. Remember, if you want to get your hands on some free V-Bucks, simply make sure you're subscribed to this channel and have that bell button ticked. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. Winners are picked and contacted via direct message here on YouTube and I will send you a code for 2800 V-Bucks for either PC, PlayStation or Xbox One. So good luck to everybody who tries to enter. Thanks as always for stopping by people and hopefully I will see you on that next one. Always in the wrong Knowing where we stand